cities in the UK. Glasgow. Glasgow is the perfect destination if you're dreaming of a city break that offers culture, history and plenty of things to do. Discover everything you need to know about Glasgow from its must-see attractions to the best ways to get around. Glasgow is Scotland's largest city, located along the River Clyde. It is situated in the lowlands but is considered part of the highlands. The town resides a population of around 600,000 people, making it the fifth largest city by population in the UK based on the 2020 City Monitor record. Glasgow has a rich history and was once one of the most important industrial cities in the world. Today, it is a growing tourist destination hub for business and higher education. The city is home to two universities, the University of Glasgow and Strathclyde University, and many other colleges and institutions. It is also a place with thriving arts and beautiful architectural landmarks, and it was named European City of Culture in 1990 and European Capital of Sport in 2003. The city has a long and rich history dating back to the 12th century when St Mungo founded it. Glasgow grew steadily throughout the medieval period and became an important centre for trade by the 16th century. The city's shipbuilding and tobacco industries made it one of the wealthiest cities in the world by the 18th century and a key player in the British Empire. Glasgow suffered during the Industrial Revolution like many other cities, but it soon regained footing and became a major centre for heavy industry in the late 19th and early 20th centuries. The city was heavily bombed during World War II, but much of its historical architecture remained intact. Glasgow began to regenerate in the 1980s and today it is a thriving metropolis with a diverse economy. People and Culture Glasgow is a cosmopolitan city with a diverse population. According to the 2011 UK census, the ethnic makeup of the city was White 88.3%, Asian 8.1%, Black 2.4%, Mixed and Other 1.2%. The city inhabits a large Irish community and there is also a significant Polish population. Glasgow resides some refugees and asylum seekers from all over the world. The Glasgow people are known for their friendliness and sense of humour and the city was named the friendliest city in the UK multiple times. Glasgow has a strong sense of community and locals are proud of their city. The city also has a vibrant and colourful music and art scene. It is famous for the Scottish Opera, the Scottish Ballet, the National Theatre of Scotland and several smaller theatre companies. Several museums and galleries in Glasgow are also worth a visit as they tell the story of Glasgow's history, culture and traditions. Getting to Glasgow Glasgow is well connected and can be easily reached by other public transportation. If you're coming from the United Kingdom, the best way to get to Glasgow is by train. There are regular services from all major cities including London, Edinburgh and Birmingham and the journey takes around four to five hours. If you're coming from outside the UK, the best way to get to Glasgow is by flying into Glasgow Airport, which is located just outside the city centre. There are direct flights from many cities worldwide including London, New York, Paris and Dubai. Once you've arrived, you can take the bus or train to the city centre. When to visit? There is no better time to visit Glasgow than from April to October when the weather is mild and plenty of events and festivals occur. However, the city can be busy during this time, so if you're looking for a more relaxed trip, it's best to visit in the winter. The biggest festival in Glasgow is undoubtedly the Celtic Connections Music Festival, which takes place every January. The festival celebrates Celtic and world music and features performances by some of the world's best musicians. Other popular festivals include the Glasgow West End Festival, the Merchant City Festival, the Glasgow International Comedy Festival, the Glasgow Film Festival and the TRN SMT Music Festival. Whatever time you choose to visit, Glasgow is a city that has something for everyone and you're sure to have a memorable trip. Cost of living The cost of living in Glasgow is relatively affordable, especially compared to other major cities in the UK and Europe. Generally, food and drink prices are lower than the average and plenty of affordable housing options are available. Transportation costs are also fair and a weekly travel pass will only set you back around £17.50. To save even more, consider getting a bike. Glasgow is an incredibly bike-friendly city and it's an excellent way to see the sights. 
when it comes to entertainment, there are plenty of free or low-cost things to do in Glasgow. As mentioned above, the Kelvin Grove Art Gallery and Museum is one of the most popular tourist attractions in the city, and it doesn't cost a thing to enter. There are also several parks and green spaces, including Glasgow Green and the Botanic Gardens. And of course, no visit to Glasgow would be complete without watching a football match. You can usually find tickets for around £20. Glasgow is an affordable city to live in, and you'll be able to stretch your budget further here than in most other places. The daily expenses are pretty reasonable, and you'll be able to get by on a budget without too much difficulty. Crime rate Glasgow has a relatively high crime rate compared to other UK cities. In 2018, over 6,000 violent crimes were recorded in Glasgow, and the town also had one of the country's highest knife crime rates. While the overall crime rate is high, Glasgow is still considered a safe place to visit since the vast majority of crimes committed are non-violent. It's a popular tourist destination and millions of visitors come to the city every year without incident. Nevertheless, taking precautions and being aware of your surroundings is always imperative. If possible, avoid walking alone at night and don't carry valuables with you in busy areas. Just use common sense and take precautions and you'll be fine. Nightlife Glasgow is a city that comes to life at night. The pubs, clubs and restaurants, from traditional Scottish pubs with live music and whiskey galore to trendy wine bars and craft beer pubs are all buzzing with people and there is always something going on. There is also a good mix of nightclubs with something to suit everyone's taste. Glasgow's nightlife is not just about drinking though, plenty of restaurants are serving up late night food too. Glasgow is the place to be if you're looking for a good time. Must-see attractions No visit to Glasgow would be complete without seeing some of the city's most famous landmarks and attractions. Here are a few of the must-see sites in Glasgow. The Kelvin Grove Art Gallery and Museum The world-renowned museum is one of Glasgow's most popular tourist attractions and it's easy to see why. The Kelvin Grove houses an impressive collection of paintings, sculptures and artefacts from all over the world and it's a magnificent place to spend an afternoon exploring. Admission is free, so there's no excuse not to visit. Glasgow Cathedral This historic sanctuary is one of the most important religious sites in Scotland and it's also a significant tourist destination. Glasgow Cathedral was built in the 12th century and was one of the best preserved medieval buildings in the country. Visitors can explore the beautiful Gothic building, learn about its history and even climb to the tower top for astonishing views of Glasgow. The Glasgow School of Art Designed by world-famous architect Charles Rennie Mackintosh, the Glasgow School of Art is one of the most distinctive buildings in the city. It's considered one of Mackintosh's masterpieces and it's definitely worth a visit even if you're not particularly interested in architecture. The school has produced some of the most remarkable artists in the world and its campus is absolutely stunning. The Riverside Museum this museum is dedicated to Glasgow's transportation history, where you can find an abundant collection of artefacts and exhibits. From vintage cars to boats and bicycles, the Riverside Museum has something for people with a considerable interest in vehicles and transportation. Interactive displays are also accessible, where you can learn about the city's shipbuilding heritage and how Glasgow became a central hub for transportation. There are many attractions in Glasgow, and these are just some of them. Whether interested in history, art or culture, you'll find plenty to see and do in this vibrant city. Glasgow is a stunning city with plenty to offer tourists and residents alike. Glasgow offers fun and knowledge about the city's culture in Scotland, from its world-renowned museums and art galleries to its stunning architecture and historical sites. Glasgow is a great place to visit if you're on a budget, since living costs are low and there are plenty of free activities to enjoy. Just be sure to take precautions against crime and be aware of your surroundings and you'll have a great time in Glasgow. Have you been to Glasgow? What did you think of the city? Let us know in the comments below. Thank you for watching this video. Please don't forget to subscribe, comment and turn on the notification bell. This is Learning Canteen.